Metro Health weighing in about hydro, hydroxychloroquine after President Donald Trump told reporters that he was taking it as a preventative to COVID-19. Devin Clark has the damaging side effects and reminds us what officials say you can do to reduce your chances of contracting the disease. Despite President Donald Trump touting the malaria drug hydroxychloroquine as a possible way to prevent the coronavirus, Metro Health Director Dr. Junda Wu is advising against it. We don't have conclusive science right now to show that it helps. Dr. Wu says taking the drug could yield dangerous side effects. The most serious one that I can think of, and it's not that uncommon, can be changing your heart rate. Even when prescribed for malaria in hospital settings, Dr. Wu says patients who receive hydroxychloroquine are closely monitored and receive echocardiograms, which show a person's heart activity. She isn't saying that the drug could not have an effect on the coronavirus, but it's too early to tell. So that's why we need randomized controlled trials to really know. For now, Dr. Wu says the best lines of defense against contracting the coronavirus are free and do not need to be prescribed. The best things that you can do are to maintain a six foot distance from other people and to not touch your face with unwashed hands. In terms of treatments, plasma transfusion trials throughout the country are showing positive results. And Dr. Wu says that it is promising that the FDA gave emergency use authorization for the drug remdesivir, which is right now being studied at UT Health and being sent to five San Antonio hospitals, including Methodist Hospital and Methodist Hospital Stone Oak. Devin Clark, KSAT 12 News.